Holiday seasons are celebrated differently all over the world. The holiday season is celebrated differently all over the world. And we have a hall of books here that might enlighten you a little if you're willing to be enlightened. about the origins of the winter solstice and the origin of some of the seasons, holidays, decorations. If you'll bear with me a second while I get close to the camera. We'll take a quick look at these books. In all sincerity, in all honesty, I truly want to see the world happy, healthy, and wise. And this is my way of trying to help the world this is one of the uh, first books printed about magic mushrooms Soma Divine Mushroom of Immortality by R. Gordon Wasson This started a whole series, a whole cascade of investigation into natural psychedelics. I had the Life magazine in my own possession about the Mexican magic mushroom, but my father threw it out. My father threw the Life magazine out, apparently because it frightened him. But Life Magazine did an expose about the magic mushroom and the origin of Soma. The winter solstice and the holiday season. Astrotheology and shamanism. Astral Theology and Shamanism. At the bottom it says, Unveiling the Law of Duality in Christianity and Other Religions. We'll have to go into this book a little bit deeper. For if you are open-minded, and if you are curious and inquisitive about why and how we celebrate the holiday seasons, this book is very informative and very enlightening. Just one more book. For now. This book. The Mushroom. In Christian Art. The 
the mushroom in Christian art. The book has a uh, picture CD in the back that shows many, many images of the mushroom in Christian art. The ideology of Jesus in the development of Christianity. Which the book says, the identity of Jesus in Christianity. The light isn't very good, so I don't know if you can see it. But we'll turn the book open, and you can see that there's a picture. This has got a CD with a lot of images in Christian art. of the magic mushroom in Christianity. The blurb on the book says the identity of Jesus in the development of Christianity. We'll come back to this too maybe as time goes on as time goes by. <laughs> 